Peter Malark. Hi guys, so I am back with this video that I've done. I think this is my sixth year doing this on YouTube and that is my Christmas wish list. I do have Loki right here in my lap. So, you know, I've got to pet him the whole time. So I'm just gonna go ahead and dive right in. This is obviously for fun and also just ideas if you need some for either yourself or someone you're shopping for so i'm just gonna share with you guys the things that i've just been like thinking about or i've been eyeing whether they're like it saved in a wish list of mine from certain stores or whatever i'm just gonna go down a list and tell you guys what i want for christmas it's funny because i was looking back at my previous wish list and a lot of those things still apply um, I will link what I can that's like shoppable, but like the first thing I can't really link, but I'll go ahead and throw it out there. But I still want to see my favorite ballet dancer in one of her ballets, which is Yasmin. She's with the Royal Ballet Company. Would love to go to hop over and go to the, you know, cross the pond and go watch her dance. Add a hat because you know it's going to appear in this video somewhere. But every year there are hats that I want. I'm just a baseball cap kind of girl. Actually, backstory to this, I didn't always used to be. My daughter did like this like city cheerleading thing and her cheerleading coach uh, ended up being a good friend of mine and she like wore the cutest hats and then one day I was over at her house and we were in her closet and I saw all of her hats and I was just like that I, I want to be you and I've been a hat girl kind of ever since so there is a white one with like black Nike font that I've been eyeing a few others um, like I love certain ones that I see on Etsy that have like really cute embroidery details and Something fun with like maybe like a gingerbread man, which I already kind of have something like that um, I just love baseball caps in general. So can't ever go wrong with that um, the other things <laughs> He loves to walk under the tree the other th things which I just got into this past year and I'm obsessed and I it's so hard for me to wear a normal purse but that's bum bags they just like they're like a crossbody bag they're a lot smaller um, they're like a fanny pack right essentially and there's two that I'm eyeing both of them on are on Amazon one is an adidas one which has like a clear bag and then one is a Nike bag which is like all black even I think the font is black so the whole thing is just monochromatic which I really love the next thing I feel like is probably one that's on a lot of lists and it's just something pretty generic and that's pots and pans however I want specific pots and pans because I've just started learning about nonstick and the chemicals that are used in, in making those things. And so I'm eyeing certain pots and pans that are like chemical free, all of these things It's supposed to be completely healthy for you. And I think it's time for me to just kind of get rid of what I have. Some of them even have like, um, which need to go immediately because I've read that like once they kind of have like the scratch mark things, yeah, I could like leak into food and stuff. So I definitely feel like I could benefit from some pots and pans. I'll link the ones that I'm looking at specifically down below. The Honestly. next things I have been looking at for a really long time, but girl, let me tell you, when I play my little let's add to the cart game, which does anybody else do this? Um, I do this with so many different stores and it's literally just for fun, I never check out. But I did this with Stony Clover. I follow them on Instagram. I love their bags, especially when I found out they started doing like neutral colors. So when I first found them, I was really into like loving more colors like pastel pinks and purples now i'm like white black beige navy brown green like that's kind of it um and stony clover has like a black line of like their travel bags and all the things i would just love to have 
their little travel set the bag with like the monogram patches but i also want like my monogram patches to be black so it's like a little monochromatic look but it's one of those gifts where i feel like it can be very personalized so it's kind of hard to like gift it unless you know exactly what the person wants because stony clover does something really cute they have like a ton of patches you can pick as well they don't just do lettering patches they do like city patches country patches lipstick uh, you know all kinds of fun little things hearts stars like all of those things so i i would really love to have like a stony clover line but the point of the story is when i put everything i wanted into a cart which was like five five things was like a thousand dollars i said you can keep it this next item i've had in my amazon cart for years and honestly it's like one of those things where i'm just gonna throw it out there it is something that i wish for but it's also something that i know that like i would have to realistically buy for myself but that is an air cleaner or air purifier but it's like the the big ones the ones that like um are just top of the line and they really do like clean your entire air and it's crazy because you know when you're just kind of like puttering around the house you really don't realize what is actually in your air and sometimes you can see it which you know like when the sun hits a certain spot just right in your house you can like see the little you know dust particles kind of flying around you can just see all the little things those, those don't just appear when the sun hits, right? Those are around like all the time when you can't even see it. And I'm just like, I really could benefit from that, especially with me always kind of ending up with bronchitis all the time. And if I were to ever receive gift cards, here are the places I think I would love to get a gift card from um, Tuesday morning. I would love to have a gift card from Tuesday morning um, and also like online places like AliExpress. I don't know if they do gift cards at all or not. Um, but AliExpress, love love the like shops where you can just get, you can go in. There's just a variety of things you can pick up. And I you know, have like a lot of like water tumblers and stuff. I love those because I fill up my water that way, just straight out of my fridge. And I really want to actually kind of move away from the plastic bottles that I have and move into glass bottles because glass is just healthy. I don't th I don't know, somebody correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think there's anything wrong with glass bottles, but with plastics, unless they're like BPA free and they have all of the other little things. Um, yeah, I just kind of want to kind of exit out of plastic and do glass bottles. So I think there's like some that I've been looking at on Amazon. Um, so yeah, just kind of do that upgrade, I guess. A couple of other things that are on my Amazon wish list are like a two piece workout suit, but of course in black, like I love those. I recently just bought one for myself not too long ago. It's like a, a black sports bra with the matching leggings and I'm obsessed with it. And yes, I have a black set, but I would love another one and it's like for me it all looks different you know there's like different textures and like little you know grooves and things in certain ones so there is another set that I've been looking at and I just love those that's what I wear pretty much every day so in terms of makeup just anything like a vitamin c serum I've ran out of mine so I definitely want to get a new set of vitamin C, Amazon. And the other thing, which is not actually from Amazon, but that's an eyeshadow palette, Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette, like the, the OG one, like from the very beginning before Jaclyn started her own cosmetics line. Um, what palette is it? The 3350 or whichever one that's called. Um, I love that palette and i know i think it's still being sold at ulta so also for me i love coloring books and a really great place to actually look for those is on amazon because there's just it's crazy you can also actually create your own coloring book and sell it on amazon so it's just it's such a cool thing but for me i've actually been looking at this i have like two um 
artists that I really love. I love the ones that are Creative Haven. Um, I'll link some of them down below. She does like romantic country scenes and it's just like really fun like prints to color in. So anything by her and I think she has like over a hundred coloring books to choose from. The other um, thing that's really cute and this is from Etsy um, and that is little charms for your smartwatch or apple watch um i recently just got one and it was actually on my christmas list i think the last couple of years and i just like caved and and got one but what i love about the the apple watch thing really because i really am still a very traditional watch kind of girl i do prefer that more than this but i like this because it's counting my steps so it was like really kind of the selling point for me um but also you can add cute little charms i'm gonna take this off because obviously i'm not showing that well enough and i did pick these up from etsy and they're like the little christmas charms they are super cute um yeah, and I've actually been eyeing some that are like Star Wars themed. So like once Christmas is over, you know, I want to still have like some like normal everyday charms that I could add to my watch. And there's some really cute ones from Star Wars that I've been looking at. So I'll like throw up pictures of them. They're not so much like dangly charms. They're like little flat ones, I guess. I don't know. Band buddies. I don't know or that's just a lady that sells them. But there's so many cute ones that I've been looking at. They even have like Harry Potter ones, um, really, really cute. So yeah, just like charms for my Apple Watch, I love. And not only do they do charms, but they also do, and I'll just throw up a picture. They also do these like little bracelets that go around your Apple Watch. And it's super cute and you can do initials, you can do, um, there's even some sellers who sell like a little set and it's like really cute. It's like adding little jewelry to your Apple Watch, which is just like, that's just genius to me. Um, I'm just trying to like bounce around some of my apps and trying to think of like different things because I really didn't come that prepared for this list. And at this point, I'm just like, you know, just throwing some things in because um, just want to again, give you guys ideas. And like I said, I really love these videos. They're really fun to just kind of like see things. Um, what was the one that was like just inside my head and I forgot? Oh, there is a lady on Instagram and I follow her. I know that she does link like certain things that she finds. So I know that she doesn't like make everything. I don't even know if she makes anything, period. Um, but just the way that she constructed her Filofax was absolutely everything. I And it's like this beautiful beige leather filofax and then all of her inserts and everything again very very neutral and it just was it was it's been a complete inspiration to me and i just want to like copy that whole thing because it's such a pretty planner it's really funny because i'm sitting here kind of looking down at my list and there's a couple of things like i didn't decide to like mention but i'll verbally mention them. i'm just not gonna throw out pictures for them i wrote time <laughs> On my Christmas list, wish list, I wrote time. And I did that because I've really been in this season in my life where I'm like, I really want to bake. I really want to plan and craft. And I just don't have the time. Um, so it's something that I'm definitely working on. I wrote like Ugg slippers, even though I don't really actually care, to be honest, about um, brand names specifically, unless it's something like Adidas or or Nike, like I love those things. Um, but I think there were these Ugg slippers that just looked really cute and they have like this band that went around the back of the heel and I don't know, I just liked the way it looked but I really don't know if I would ever wear that. Do you ever do that? You're just like, oh yeah, I, I like that but like, I don't know. So I, there's that. I also wrote a printer. I definitely need a different printer that can handle like cardstock, anything like for crafting. So I was watching this YouTube video on like some really good printers for that. And um, the ones that I'm, that were on there are like sold out right now. So 
it's kind of unfortunate. With but me, you also can't ever go wrong with like a graphic tee. I do like to size like one size or two sizes up from like my normal size. I just like a certain fit, you know, especially because I wear leggings all the time. Um, I love a good graphic tee. I think it's just such a cute way to style outfits. But that is going to be it for today's video. I hope that you guys enjoyed the list. Drop your Christmas wish list down below too. I definitely want to like read through and see like what you guys are thinking about. And also I'm going to get some ideas from you guys too. So anyways, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Loki's passed out at my feet. Um, I can't really show you guys because it'd be, well, hang on. Let me see. Just, whoa. Got him right here. So cute, you guys. He's he's a little attached, not by much. Um, but anyways, so thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.